What's at stake today, Congresswoman? Well, look, I think today, uh, no matter what the outcome is, is certainly the beginning uh, of, of a battle that, that is going to continue and is going to go on. And uh, as a country, we're facing uh, very challenging and difficult times. Uh, we're facing a moment where uh, our democracy really is uh, under attack and under threat. And those of us uh, across the board, Republicans, Democrats, and Independents, who believe deeply in freedom and who care about the Constitution and the future of the country, uh, I think have an obligation to, to put that above party. Uh, and uh Hey guys, this is Matt in exile. And I was glad that video was over because I was tired of listening to her talk and giving excuses of why she did what she did. Uh, I already know the excuse. And this is the real excuse. It's because she hates Donald Trump. She's part of the neocon faction of the Republican Party, which do not belong in the Republican Party. They belong in the Democrat Party. That's the part of the parties that like long, drawn-out wars because they make money off of it. Go to the Democrat Party. Do not stay here in the, in the uh, Republican Party. You have no place here. Not only that, anytime you vote against the Second Amendment, like she did on that bill that just passed the Senate and the House uh, for uh, uh, limiting uh, access of certain uh, weapons, guess what? You don't belong in the, in the Republican Party because of that as well. And you live in Wyoming. Voting against the Second Amendment is not a good idea. So she would have lost anyway, in my opinion. Now, if you look at this poll here, she has 30% of the vote. And uh, you have Harriet Hengelman, who has 56% of the vote. Even if she gets that extra 14%, she only has 44% of the vote. She loses. And she's so desperate, she had to dig up her dad out of the grave to go and vote for it. Not only that, she's had to go and Beg Democrats, the few that are in Wyoming, to go and vote for. And uh, I don't know if it's going to work or not. I don't think it is. Because I think uh, I think uh, uh, Hegelman is going to win by 20%, if not more. But guys, this is good news. We're going to get Liz Cheney out of office. And, uh, and uh, Wyoming's going to have a good representative in the House. But guys, this is the end of the video. I hope you enjoy. Please hit like and subscribe. It helps the channel grow. Peace.